Kevin Durant is one of four Brooklyn Nets players who have tested positive for the coronavirus. The Nets said that one of the four players is exhibiting symptoms. The other three are asymptomatic. Durant told The Athletic that he is feeling fine and urged people to be careful. And here is our friend Jay Williams, who was very close with Kevin Durant as well. What was your reaction, Jay Will, when you heard that KD tested positive for the coronavirus? Karina, I found out while, while I was doing a podcast yesterday, and Monday afternoon, late afternoon, myself, KD, and Rich were all on the phone discussing what our content strategy was going to be and you know what Kevin's stances were and different things and what we were actually going to talk about as far as breaking down players, and you know he felt fine. He seemed fine. Everything was okay. He was back in New York City. Everything was great. And same with Rich and same with myself. So as you can imagine, yesterday, everybody was just pretty much shocked uh, at the, the news. And, you know, everybody kind of went their own different ways. Obviously, Rich worried about his family. Kevin worried about himself. And we all haven't gotten a chance to get on the phone yet. But I'm just glad that he's OK. I mean, this thing is affecting anybody and everybody. Uh, Greeny, you know, nobody is immune to this. So I'm just glad he's OK. Uh, but as of two days ago, everything was completely fine, Greeny. Everything was normal as usual. And again, he, he's told the, uh, the athletic that he is at this point asymptomatic, at least that was of yesterday. I'd just be curious, Jay, because you talk to so many people around the league, and it's a strange time for the NBA to say the very least as they are sitting and waiting to see what happens next. Just what sorts of conversations are you hearing from NBA players and others around the league about uh, the situation right now? Uncertainty, Greedy. Guys have no idea what to do. Uh, you know, guys want to go back to the practice facility. They have hopes that they can have a season this year. They want to continue to train, keep their bodies in alignment. But then you, you can't do that because you have lack of resources. Now, they can still do that on their own. But when you make yourself available to other people, trainers, basketball trainers, staff and company, then potentially you can get yourself or you can contract the virus. So guys are extremely weary of who they surround themselves with. And, you know, just like everybody else, people are staying quarantined. These guys are staying at home, staying with their families, very unsure of where to go, how to train, how to work out. And everything is just up in limbo right now. I know we have hopes of having an NBA season, but the more and more we continue down this path, my man, it does not look like that's going to be the case. Yeah, Woj said earlier today a lot of owners are looking for some sort of clarity, and right now that is just not available. Jay Will, thank you so much. Stay safe, my friend, and we will check in with you as we continue. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.